Now, I want to read verse 4. "...and with you there shall be a man of every tribe, every one head of the house of his father." Now, the reading of this book, and certainly the way it starts off here at this census, well, it's not as thrilling as a mystery story, let's say. You can enjoy one of Hitchcock's plays on television more maybe than this. But you have here 54 verses of unnecessary details, and they may be quite boring. But you know, it was important to God, and if we'll just recognize some great truths that are here, it ought to be thrilling for us. First of all, God's interested in individuals. Mass movements, I think, have their place, and certainly not rugged individualism. But you know, God's interested in redeemed individuals. God's interested in every individual. And Moses and Aaron was to take a census, and they were to have one assistant from each tribe. And you'll find out names of these men that were assistants that are given here. And if you think I'm going down through that list of names, you're wrong. To begin with, they're not easy to pronounce. But it reveals that every name there was important to God. And I just lift out one verse for you, and all these names mean something. And if you get to the Hebrew meaning of the names, you'll have a wonderful message. Now I'm reading verse 5. These are the names of the men that shall stand with you of the tribe of Reuben, Eliezer, the son of Shadur. Now isn't that interesting or isn't that thrilling to you, friends? Well, Reuben... He was the eldest son, and he was set aside. Back in Genesis 49, 3 and 4, we were told he's unstable as water, and that was true of him. But he's going to pick out a man that's a little different to help, and the man that's picked out is Eliezer, the son of Shadur. Eliezer is, my God is a rock, and Shadur, the Almighty is a fire. And I like that. This man, Eliezer, and my God is a rock. He may belong to a tribe that's unstable as water, but this fellow knew if you got up on a rock, why, it's like the little Scotch lady said, I may tremble on the rock, but the rock never trembles under me. And he found out that there is a rock, and they had sung that song of Moses that God was their rock. And he makes a shadow in a weary land. He also is a foundation for us to rest on. And you may be an unstable person, but friends, it'd be just wonderful indeed to have one like that here.